Hello Capricorn, always coming through with the views. You are one of the zodiac signs that got the most views for July monthly reading. So you will be receiving a pop-up peak reading for the month of August. We're just going to jump right into things. But I wanted to give you a little heads up first. I will be having a special on two different types of readings. The first reading is a reading that I'm introducing, okay? It's going to be an astrology reading, basically a birth chart reading. So I'm, I'm in it. Okay, I'm very interested whenever it comes to planets and placements. So I thought, why not? I also had a few people, you know, kind of, you know, give me some incentive to go ahead and at least try it out, right? So I will be offering birth chart readings where it ranges from who is your alter ego, okay? Who is your shadow self? What type of people do you attract whenever it comes to friends, love, and dating? What are your strengths and weaknesses? And what is your career path, okay? I will be doing those readings for 3535, all right? Because it's a new reading, okay? I start off at the low ski. At the low ski, okay? All the information to book a reading with me will be in the description box down below. I will also be running a special on my monthly readings, okay? Um, so just basically reading messages for you for the entire month of August. Okay, any placement of Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Mercury, Rising, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, North, No, and South, No Place for anybody who would like to be nosy. All the info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. It will keep me in your rotation. YouTube, do not be pushing me around, girl. So it's up to us. <laughs> it's up to us, girl. Okay, so. What we're going to do first is pull one card to see what your overall energy is going to be going into the month of August and during the month of August. And then we're going to do a spread for you guys, okay? I'm going to give you a quick shuffle. Oh, wee. Okay. Spirit, guys, what is Capricorn's overall energy going into the month of August and during the month of August? In the year 2023, what's going to be the overall ah, what's going to be their overall energy going into the month of August and during the month of August in the year 2023? Um, this was real random. Some of y'all might be getting some jewelry, whether it be for the wrist, whether it be for the wrist, the ears, the neck, the head. I just heard. I don't know. They could be like hair charms or something like that. I do see that some of y'all could be buying some jewelry going into the month of August and during the month of August. Ace of Swords. Is it cutting off season eight? Okay, Ace of Swords. This for me could be um you deciding to get rid of something, you deciding to separate from something, you getting hit with a reality check in regards to something, you signing some sort of policy, documents, enrollment. Is it back to school for some of your kids? Okay. Um, what else could this be? Ooh, nine of swords. Okay. Um, I see something that you guys were worried about. It's like um getting the result of or getting the result of or the goddamn getting the result. Girl, why am I so country? Or outcome of a certain situation that you were stressing over. It's like you um you get the results of stuff. It's like if you take a test and you're scared about 333 confirmations, thank you. If you take a test and you're worried about what your grade is gonna be, you're gonna find out what the grade is gonna be, basically, okay? Can y'all hear that fucking dog slash werewolf in the back? Um, I'm not sure who it is, but some people over here, they just got um they got like two pet Dobermans, girl, in every fucking morning. It never it never not happens. I don't know if these niggas let this dog on like the back patio and they be script they be howling to be let back in. They gotta be puppies. I don't know if the grown dogs with them like good, good googly moogly. I couldn't imagine living with that. All right, girl. guys what's going on with the capricorn zodiac going into the month of august and during the month of august in the year 2023 four of cups with the emperor god damn it two different scenarios came to mind you fucking hate your job i wouldn't say you hate it 
I wouldn't say you hate it, but with the four of cups, it's like, girl, what else? Okay, it's like you come in, you do the exact same thing. You don't feel like you're where you want to be. It's like, girl, no seasoning. The food ain't got no seasoning, okay? Some of y'all might feel like life could be a little bit bland and your job ain't really helping. I say job because the emperor card is showing up on the bottom of the deck with the ace of swords, okay? It's like, girl, I want to make my own money. <laughs> I don't want to be reliant on anything or anybody, right? Eesh. And then here's the other one. Oh, okay. okay. Why am I yelling? It's too early for this, okay? Ten of Swords, Emperor, Tower, and the King of Wands. Or, some of y'all remember Ace of Swords. Didn't I say you went cutting off season? Some of y'all I see cut off a certain situation here with the water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, a fire sign, Aries, very strong, or an air sign, Gemini is very strong. And now with the four of cups, I think this person missing you. Four of cups ain't traditionally your energy, 555 confirmation. So I don't think this is you. Because remember, Ace of Swords, you kind of like, then the Nine of Swords came out. It's like, some of y'all might wonder why, it's like, I'm getting tired of saying the word like, you ever have the thought or the memory of somebody come to mind? It's like, girl, what the fuck is this? Why am I thinking about this person? Because this person is thinking about you. Or Capricorn. This is you to someone. But for it's a, it's a, it's a small percentage of Capricorns. I say like 5%. <laughs> I say like 5% of Capricorns are feeling this way towards someone. But they could be. But most of y'all, this is someone feeling this way towards you, okay? Yeah, Ten of Swords and the Judgment card. Someone here wishes that something wasn't over between y'all. Someone here, even though it was the right thing, Judgment card, it was the right thing for things to be over with y'all. I mean, how many times have y'all tried to rekindle shit? There's a lot of swords in her back. So with the Ace of Swords, you was like, girl, instead of breaking my own heart, you're done, okay? Curtains. I, I don't want to deal with it anymore, okay? Yep, lover's card. Some of y'all is definitely in regards to an air sign, or uh, air, water, or a fire sign. Aries is strong. Cancer, Scorpio, Gemini was very strong, okay? Mm-hmm. <laughs> It's not funny, but I'm hearing it. A choice had to be made. There is vodka in this. And I'm playing this. is fruit and ginger, girl. I ain't on vacation. That's when I be drinking in the morning. Spirit, spirit guys, I'm on vacation. Spirit guys, <laughs> what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac? Going into the month of August and during the month of August in the year 2023. Queen of Wands. Is this his bitch? Okay, we just saw the King of Wands. And now we're seeing the Queen of Wands. Girl, this is trash. Five of Pentacles. Oh, no. Now, Five of Pentacles can technically be your energy, Capricorn, even though it is Taurus energy. But this, for me, is with the Four of Cups and the Queen of Wands. Feeling, you kind of feel like this energy of, I feel like I've lost my spark. I feel like I've lost my spark, my edge, okay? And I'm going to be honest with you, with the Four of Cups, it's either because you're in this, you know, uh, like, what's, what's the energy that I'm looking for, y'all? I don't care. This very strong, apathetic energy. And I feel like it might be coming out, coming out in the way that you walk, in the way that you talk, your personality. You're really not going through, you're not going through the extra lengths to put yourself together, you know? Five of Pentacles, some of y'all, you could feel like, I just heard, you could feel like your money is suffering during this time. It's like, girl, I just, I got a lot going on, okay? Well, I'll say this. Five of Pentacles, World Card, and the Chariot. Now you know the World Card for me it could be a, uh, could be about learning hard lessons, and with the Chariot card, this is in regards to moving forward. So with the Five of Pentacles, it's kind of like even if you feel like you don't have enough, are you still going to move forward? You know, or with the Four of Cups, are you going to be like you know, you know, Five of Cups is woe is me. Four of Cups is like what's the point? What's the point? You know. Girl, I don't know what to tell you because I'm in that energy. Anyway, three o'clock. <laughs> it's, it's like, um, what's, what's, what am I looking for? Ace of Swords. You kind of got to cut yourself out of that space. You know, with the Ace of Swords, this for me is, you know, getting real about a certain situation. It's like, hey, girl, I can, I can be the only one that pulls myself out of this depression, out of this badass energy. Okay. Three of Cups. Some of y'all, this is people that you have around you currently. 
whether it be friends, family, lovers, or these are people that you have gotten away from. People that kind of make you feel insignificant, undervalued, underappreciated. Ladies, it's you. Queen of Pentacles is here. Ace of Pentacles and the Two of Pentacles. Yeah, some of y'all are still attached to these people. Friends, family, lovers, okay? Not knowing that you, my dear, are the prize or the Ace of Pentacles. It's like you bring light into other people. You bring light into other people's lives. You bring opportunities. You bring, um, oh girl, thank God that was an opening, okay? It's like you had you bring you bring something to the table, as they would say. You have value, right? You need to be careful of being all used up. Being used up by individuals, okay? But like I said, some of y'all had gotten away from people like that. Mysterious guys, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of August and during the month of August in the year 2023? King of Cups. With the Hierophant. Girl, you don't have time for this. Let me tell you what you don't have time for. This, okay? I told y'all, some of y'all, there's a air, oh girl, air, water, or fire sign individual who I think misses you. They're probably bored with a certain situation that they're in during this time, all right? Ace of Swords out here. I don't even think this is someone that you're talking to or you talk to on the regular. Heavy on the Cancer, heavy on the Scorpio, heavy on the Aries, Leo, and Sag. We got 10 and the Five of Wands showing up. Um, with the Hierophant out here. Yeah, oh my God, girl. Some people, they are currently going through this with the Hierophant. They could be connected to, married to, in a relationship with this individual. Ten of Wands and the Five of Wands. There's fights. I hope DV, domestic violence, ain't going on in this certain situation. Or just Ten of Wands and the Five of Wands. These people have, oh, have. I'm about to start the whole reading over, girl. I can't talk. These people have a lot of issues and problems going on between one another. And it's kind of making them wonder what all is out there um, outside of their relationship. This is someone here that, like I said, is thinking about you during this time. One with the higher fan, it's like someone here that you was divine led and guided away from. Okay. So, here, guys, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of August and during the month of August in the year 2023? Knight of Cups with the Judgment. This this the type of reading is gonna be. Somebody here wants to pursue you, girl, Capricorn. Your energy's still not out here in this reading, so I feel like I'm reading for somebody else. The audacity, the audacity for somebody to come in your reading and be like, read them. Or well, there's some water and fire signs in here, and they being nosy. I said that that happened, but. There is someone here that with the four cups and the knight of cups, I heard it wishes they would have pursued you, pursued you or taken you a lot more seriously. Judgment card, let me back in. It's like they pounding on your door. Excuse me. I don't want to get the authority. Stop banging on my door like that. Judgment, hangman, the four swords, yeah. I don't like that. I don't like it at all because it's only when this person realizes that they're not happy in another situation they're like oh well i should have went with capricorn i should have pursued capricorn nigga and or bitch why didn't you know that beforehand it's like some people need to understand that they don't get a second go around with you third fourth fifth sixth eighth ninth tenth okay i i, I, I missed the seventh okay but some people are willing to roll the dice as it relates to that. They think that you'll still be there. They think that you'll still, um, you know, give them grace. And with the Ace of Swords, you're like, I'm, 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 I'm on a time limit. Okay, it's like you're not playing games with people anymore. As soon as they show you their cards, they show you that they don't really take you seriously. They don't really value you or your time. You off it. All right? Curtains. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of August and during the month of August in the year 2023? Ow, my ankle. What's going on with my fucking ankle? Okay. Okay. The star. All right. I like this. I do. 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 Yeah, girl. Some of y'all, you got to do something with yourself, honey. 
Star card is underneath the Queen of Wands and it's beside the Knight of Cups. I feel like some of you guys, if you are in this energy of feeling like, Girl, I'm going to wear sweatpants at the house and it's going to be that. Okay, I feel like you got to put a little bit more um, energy into things that you want for yourself. So if you're someone here who's trying to leave a certain job, start looking for other jobs. Start figuring out what other job you want to go towards. Start figuring out what's going to make you happy. All right, where does your fulfillment lie, babes? 15, 15, confirmation. Six of swords. Start figuring out where you want to transition to. Six of swords. Seven of Swords, Page of Cups. But one thing that can kill all of that, kill your dreams, kill your aspirations, kill your ambitions, Seven of Swords and the Page of, page of Cups is insecurity. It's insecurity or letting other people tell you what you need, what's best for your life. I mean, mentorship and advice and counsel is great. But if niggas not living your life, you can't put all your eggs in that basket of what other people think is best for you. Like I said, the guidance and counsel and, and advice is great. But you yourself got to know where you headed uh, before anything and anyone else. All right. Also, I'm seeing there was someone here that realized that they couldn't play their games around you. Whether it be emotional games, emotional manipulation. They, they're here, they there, they're everywhere. Someone here realized they couldn't do that with you. So, they bag back. Okay, they stayed away from you. Some of y'all, this was a fire, air, or a water sign individual. It's like, you're not finna just act however you wanna act around me, player, and then have a bitch on the side? Like, that's crazy. Or a dude. It's like you made it clear that someone here was not going to play with your shit. You made it clear, all right? So I feel like this, oh, wow. I feel like this person stayed away from you and they went to the weaker link. But the weaker link is that, okay? Shit falling apart, rusty and everything. It's like, now this person, you get what you pay for, basically. Be careful about buying some cheap shit. It ain't gonna last. So if y'all one of the ones buying jewelry, you can go to the mall kiosk if you like. It's cost effective, I know. But it probably won't last too long, okay? Now your neck looks like a, a green bean, okay? You don't need that in your life. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac for the month of... Uh, what's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of August and during the month of August, Spirit guys? The one card that belongs to you in this this. The devil. Are you kidding me, Capricorn? What the fuck is this? I did say there are some corny caps. Corny caps out here, okay? Who are doing that whole playing around, manipulation, and she like that, okay? Or still simping for somebody. And it's like, girl, like, do we have to be the one to tell you? We've told you. You're not listening to us. Or somebody here wants you, but they want you all for the wrong reasons. Knight of Cups, Star Card, and the Devil. They see your light. They see your value. They see what you're able to do for yourself. And with the Knight of Cups, they want that. Give it to me. Give me your wallet, okay? It's, it's giving me that energy. Give me your wallet. Are you kidding me? Nigga. Yes, with the Ace of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. Ladies, I'm probably talking to a lot of y'all. Men, y'all probably in here too because the Emperor card came out. Divine Masculine. Hello, 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 okay? I really feel like you need to be careful. See, this is the bullshit I don't like. Page of Swords, Two of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, and the Ace of Pentacles. You do have people around you who try to figure out your financial situation. How much you get paid. How you're able to pay for this. Like, it's like niggas trying to get into your purse. Or trying to get you to, I'm here and work for them. Work for free, Okay. Use you and abuse you because the star cards out here, you have a certain uh, what they would call a star quality about you. You need to pay the source, pay attention to who is taking from you, take or taking advantage of you. All right, and some of y'all, there's a toxic ass air or water sign outside your energy. Just, just be aware, okay? Cancer, Scorpio, probably Pisces, Aquarius, Spirit Guys. What's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of August and during the month of August in the year 2023? 
Nine of Pentacles. I N D E P E N D E N T. Cap that shoe. All right. So we have the Four of Cups, Knight of Cups, and the Nine of Pentacles. So what is this? Yeah, listen, some of y'all cannot sit here and tell me. How do I say this, girl? I don't want to come off, you know, rude or anything. Listen, some of y'all are more than capable of offending for yourself, okay? Be careful about doing this. Help! Okay, you need to be careful about doing that. And it's like, I mean, ask for help if you need it, babes. Ask for help if you need it. Ask for help if you need it. If you need a day off, tell your employer. If you can't do something anymore, tell somebody. It's like be vocal about what your needs are. Don't just eat it. Don't just eat the eat the bullshit. You know, it's like don't just deal with things and then it turns you into this, you know, lump on a log, right? If you're not happy with something or someone, girl, be vocal about it, okay? Stand up for yourself. That's what I'm hearing. Stand up for yourself, girl. And then again, I told you, there is somebody here outside your energy who is a fan of that. They're a fan of the fact that with the Nine of Pentacles and the Star card looking like this, you are someone to where it's like, I don't like this about you. You don't like to ask for help. It's like, girl, I'm going to get it done. Okay, I, I get it done. You're not the type to complain, okay? Or you're the type of person to where it's like what other people might find unattainable. You're like, hey, girl, it's just a challenge. <laughs> it's just a challenge, right? They admire that about you. Heavy on the fire, heavy on the water, heavy on the air. They might not say anything to you. It's like, niggas, they're going to give you a flower until you're dead, okay? They was such a good person. Girl, bye. Get off my coffin. Well, y'all know for me it's going to be an urn. And I'm gonna be somewhere in Egypt in the Grand Canyon. Okay, girl, cook, put me put me on the stove. I don't I don't want to be rotting the ground. Spirit guys, girl, this this planet going to shit anyway. Spirit, <laughs> Spirit guys, what's going on with the camera? We already had going into the month of August. Okay, that's crazy how that fell out. Death. Oh, girl. Got a lot going on in your energy, Capricorn, with the Page of Pentacles. Queen of Wands, Star card, and the Death. Yeah, some of y'all need to go get your hair did. You need to buy you some clothes. You need to do a, 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 a skin regimen. I don't know, girl. I don't like that I just stuttered either. I just feel like some of y'all need to go through some sort of revitalization as it relates to taking care of yourself and figuring out what you want for yourself. Maybe there was a certain direction or path that you thought you was going into where it's like, that ain't the case no more, all right? It's like you need to be able to adapt whenever you realize certain things just aren't for you, okay? Girl, here's the fucking roundabout thing, okay? Don't, don't do this. Page of Pentacles, Seven of Swords, Page of Cups, Five of Swords. You need to be careful about falling for somebody's lies, okay? Excuse me. You still thinking that there's a chance with someone here who lied, stole, cheated, betrayed you. There's no chance for redemption, okay? It's like, you can't really think that. <laughs> Death card. It's like, no, girl, they made the bed, all right? Plus with the devil card, they were toxic anyway, girl. Cut their ass out. Some of y'all, this is definitely a fire sign, an air sign, or a water sign. Aquarius is very strong. Some of y'all, I do not trust an Aquarius when it comes to you. We got a little bit of Libra and Gemini showing up, but the Aqua, I don't fuck with the Aqua, okay? So you, like I said, you need to be careful about falling for somebody's lies. Or like I said, you um, have already figured out the type of individual that this person is. They will try to, I can't tell y'all my experiences. <laughs> I'm going to say it anyway. There was this guy. This is a while back, like a year. Um, There was this guy. We known each other for a while. We knew each other for a while, right? He had asked me to hang out. He had actually asked me to spend the night with him at, you know, he, he wanted to go to some sort of like get together and everything. He was like, we can spend the night out there. That way you ain't got to worry about driving back. Mind you, not only was this nigga in a relationship. Married nigga. Marry, and I'm like, I don't think that'd be appropriate considering your current situation. And he was like, yeah, we, we just friends. Let me just preface this by saying, me and this man have a history. 
Okay, me and this man have a history. We wasn't in a serious relationship, but we did dates. Okay, we just never uh, considered anything exclusive. And girl, we had relations. No relationship, but we had relations. Trash. Anyway. I'm like, nigga, what are you talking about? And he was like, oh, we just doing things as friends. And then he tried to go all prophetic on me talking about some. He just trying to enjoy life. And he's not trying to hold on to any negative feelings or anything. And I was like, nigga, I'm younger than you. But I'm not no dumbass, okay? It's like, bro, you're married. How do you think your wife, how do you think your wife would feel about you hanging out and going to go spend a night over at some place with a woman that you have previously entertained in many different ways, okay? It's like, girl, goodbye, goodbye and good night, goodbye and good night. I wouldn't say I haven't heard from him since, but he's definitely kept his distance, okay? Because it was like, girl, what do you think I am out here? The mistress? Are you kidding me? No, okay? Niggas will talk yourself into a hole, bro. These people will stay away from you. <laughs> Those type of people will stay away from you whenever you make it clear to where it's like, what you're talking about is caca, okay? It's like, you're not making sense right now. Spirit guys, last call. What's going on with the Capricorn Zodiac going into the month of August and during the month of August in the year 2023? Like, some of y'all really just, you, you blow me. Seven of Swords. That's how we end the reading, girl. And it was aqua. I don't know. Some of you Aquarians, I just... <laughs> ah! I've met more aqua women that's been more accepting, okay? Like, it's like, I don't mind having certain aqua women around me, but the Aquarius men, girl, y'all... Y'all gotta do better, okay? <laughs> y'all gotta do better, okay? King of Cups, Devil, Seven of Swords, Nine of Pentacles, Death, Seven of Swords. So, I do see some Capricorns here. They're going to fall to temptation. They're going to let some water, air, or fire sign energy back around there. And they're going to do you dirty again. They're going to do you dirty again because now they know you set the precedent. You set the principle for how this person can treat you. They will do you dirty again. If they have before, what's stopping them from doing it again? Okay. Some of y'all, Nine of Pentacles, Death Card, and the Seven of Swords, you made it clear. Ain't no roundabouts over here, player. Ain't no spinning the block, okay? Four cups, star card, and the seven of swords. And unfortunately, people will do this. Look, mistress! Queen of wands, devil, and the seven of swords. Don't be nobody mistress. Don't fuck with nobody that got a mistress, okay? Some of y'all don't even know it. It's like this person got a, a, a standby. It's like, girl, if you say no, they got somebody else that they're going to rely on, okay? But this is also people here being bored with a certain situation, whether it be a certain relationship, or they're just bored with their own life, okay? And now they want to come back around you and get some of your light. The star is your middle card, Capricorn. You need to be careful about people doing this to you, okay? Yeah, here go the men, King of Pentacles. Y'all too, I'm speaking to y'all too, okay? Yeah. Uh, air, uh, divine feminine and divine masculine. A certain situation here with an air or a water sign is finito, girl. It's, it's done, skis. Cut the stove off, girl. It's curtains, okay? Because with the seven of swords and the devil, I don't think you want somebody like that around you. This person is honest. This person is, I heard, abusive. It ain't got to be just physical, girl. It could be emotional or spiritual. This, for me, is somebody here beat you down. I hope not physically. Emotionally, like they don't. They make you feel insecure about yourself and they go out and go fuck with other people. But then, and then you, because I've had this happen to me to where it's just like you asking yourself, well, what's wrong with me? Like, why am I making you do this? I'm not making you do a motherfucking thing. Okay, girl, you got issues. Of course, I went over, girl. I was supposed to stop the reading at 23 minutes. We went, we went five minutes over. Capricorn, this was your August month, uh, August pop-up peak reading. Okay, I don't have no other placements of Capricorn. Other than sun, but you know, y'all know how these reasons go. Like the video, leave a comment telling me if this resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. Remember, I am introducing uh, astrology slash birth chart readings. All that information will be in the description box down below, and I will be running a promo sale, promo special on my monthly readings for 4040. I think I'll be doing those for 4040. Yes. Okay, and the birth chart readings will be 35, 35. I'll have everything posted in the community tab, girl. You know, I'm not just going to leave you hanging. Okay, talk to you later. Bye.